Christian reflection mystic lightening the load the first thing we have to do is to notice that we are loaded down this camel with so much baggage we'll never get through the desert alive something has to go then we can begin to dump the thousand things we have brought along until even the camel has to go and we are walking barefoot on the desert sand there's no telling what will happen then but i have heard that someone walking in this way has been a uh, seen a burning bush how is the way to be fully human for god is in the depths of me part of me so cultivate and expand one rule for prayer is be there do not miss prayer fidelity is important do not be scared of being called a mystic for your it is a call for all human beings have no fear this is the only way to be fully human creation is a spiritual entity god's revelation the first incarnation jesus is expression of god's incarnation of creation mystic away from beliefs boundaries but it is a inner spiritual movement and experience of god it is a journey from sense to spirit from mind to heart from uh, god to god within from a uh, union with god less words but stay with god's presence prayer is love in search of the word not addressing god but expressing god deep inside it is a passion urgency longing to hold love the whole body is praying the heart hands mind energy the spirit is leading me home where i am supposed to live you choose the person of christ and let him be the basis of all your actions and endeavors the great pilgrimage i felt in need of a great pilgrimage so i sat still for 3 days and god came to me this is kabir the mystic o living flame of love by saint john of the cross o living flame of love tenderly wound my soul to its deepest inner heart without oppression come consummate our love tear through the veil of our union if it be your will come and rend the veil of the temple o lamps of fire in deep caverns o feeling once obscured and blind are now le- lending in the warmth and the passion of your love yet gently your hand does wound as you rend through the veil of my temple come and take this life that i give so that i might come to live in this our dying o living flame of love tenderly wound my soul to its deepest inner heart without oppression have you noticed any change in your life as a result of your prayer does your prayer make you more aware of what is happening in e- your life each day can you take the decision to make prayer reality central to your life in the in the priority you give to the time for prayer place for prayer regularity of prayer seeking space for god and so on are you a contemplative person do you feel you are operating out of a heightened consciousness during these days let us call on the holy spirit to help us make christ mission our own against our nature against the difficulties emptiness and poverty be spiritual but not religious because religious is more cultic all are one we are in god in ourselves and in our brethren the seeker is generous bold daring he moves in stillness grows in the inner trust and clarity about god he is never half hearted expect to change your virtues when your core is touched only then you are transformed live fully fall into the mystery called god